Good morning. So it is Boxing Day today. I'm up and getting ready for work now. It's around 7 a.m. It's a bit weird that it's Boxing Day here and I'm about to go to work and then my family back home. They'll still be celebrating Christmas Day. Yeah. But so at work today, I'm going to be teaching a little bit about Boxing Day, but mainly the whole day I'm going to teach about New Year's Day. And I'm going to show them a video of the fireworks at Big Ben because they all really like London. They all seem to know all the sites in London, so I think they'll find that interesting. Might get them to dance to Auld Lang Syne as well. <laughs> Hopefully they'll enjoy that. And yeah, so just a normal day here because I guess I've got, I've got work still, so hopefully it's a good day. Just walking back from school now. To be honest, this morning I didn't really want to go in, I wasn't looking forward to it, but yeah, it was fine. I enjoyed teaching about New Year and it went by really quickly. And then it was really sweet. The um, other people in my office got me some cake, and then some of the kids have made me Christmas cards over the weekend. And one boy gave me um, a USB in the Paper Santa, which is really cute. So it felt like Christmas part two getting all these presents and cards again today and now I am just walking to the shop to do our weekly food shop and probably clean the flat as well so like any other Monday. So I've just got back and I'm going to have my cake. These are some of the cards the kids made me. This is off one of my students, Paul. It's really cute. And then one of my uh, students, grade four, Yo-Yo, she wrote me a song, a Christmas song, which is really sweet, very good English, very impressed with it. So continuing Christmas today. So it's almost the end of Boxing Day now and I hope you've enjoyed Vlogmas. I've really enjoyed making the videos for you so I hope you've enjoyed watching them and Looking back on Christmas, I've had such a good time. I think apart from being a bit sad on Christmas Eve about not seeing my family, I've really enjoyed it and it has been different, which you know, you can expect, but different in a good way, I think. Well, we've done Christmassy things that I would do back home and we've been to familiar places and you know, seen decorations, put decorations up and done lots of familiar things we would do back home for Christmas. It's also been very different, but in a good way. I've really enjoyed it. I think it's one of the best Christmases I've had and I'm gonna remember it for ages. And I think part of that is the people I've met here because I applied for teaching in China and I met people at the orientation day in London and then at the summer camps in Beijing and I've spent Christmas with them doing Christmas get-togethers and Amy and Katie doing Christmas things with them in the flat and that's really made Christmas I think um, not even just Christmas China in general part of my experience has been meeting such really good people I really get on with them and yeah just really have enjoyed Christmas this year it's been really nice such a good time but yes, so I hope you've enjoyed these videos and given you a bit of an insight into, well, my Christmas in China. And for the last time, goodbye. Hiya everyone. So my name is Nicola and I'm currently a primary school teacher in Shanghai. I'm just gonna have tea now at home and we are making a nice tofu stir fry for our dinner and interestingly Don't want our love for Christmas There's just one thing I need I don't care about the Christmas
I've just finished getting ready for tonight. I'm going to leave in around 10 minutes or so. So, so we've not. So we've. Please don't put that. <laughs> <laughs>